Phil Vassallo explains to us what he means by masterful time management. Masterful time management, first of all, if I can break down this talk to only one word, I would say it's attitude. So masterful time management is having the right attitude about what you can reasonably do and how you can reasonably chart it out. So a masterful time manager has to always have a time management tool. I know those people who say, I have it all up here and it's not a problem. Frankly, I believe they don't have too much going on in their life. You know, they, uh, and I know people who are quite busy who do do it successfully, but they probably have a lot of people behind the scenes helping them and telling them where they got to go at such and such a time. Uh, so a masterful time manager will always have a tool, number one, and he will always or she will always record those events in their life that are important. Basically, time management every second of your life is probably coming down to things that are um, definitely imperative. Now, for me, right now, talking to you is imperative. If it weren't, it would just be important and I can put it in my planner and say I'll do it. So yesterday, this event was important to me until I came to the exact time of the, the, this um, uh, broadcast. Now, if I needed to for some reason leave this very seat, obviously it's because something more urgent, something more imperative has pulled me from this seat. And you can imagine what those circumstances might be, biological necessity, whatever, right? And then there are also things that are completely insignificant. Those are the things like twiddling my thumbs for Sheila to get me the introduction and Bobby to get me the data. That's a complete waste of time, right? So a masterful time manager knows his or her inclinations to do that and knows how to offset them.